Okay, so this week we finally started doing outreach again, and uh, we also started a new project. And it was it was a busy week, and I think that it was, I'd say it was a pretty successful week. We managed to accomplish most of the goals that we set out to do. And next week, things are going to get pretty hectic um, because we have two projects that we want to try to get done. And on top of that, we're starting like some of this new project. We have one really important call and then next week we're probably going to hear back from this other company we pitched this week as well if they want to like potentially move forward so there's a lot going on and what's so wild is that like we just spent essentially like one day doing like outreach uh and like we got good responses so that's definitely like a, a big green flag and this new project that we're thinking about messing around we're not even thinking about like we're going to do it it's just a matter of like when now when we do that and when things go very successfully with that project, when we're able to see amazing results, we're gonna have a lot more clients coming our way uh, because that will be the best way to show our expertise and our skill set. Uh, you know, it's and it's gonna be really fun. It's gonna be really fun to work on it. So I'm excited to execute on that. Uh, it's gonna be a little bit different from like what we've been doing, but it's still in the realm of like the content creation world. So I'm really excited to explore that space. And outside of that. Um, I'm I'm really looking forward to like finish these two projects that we've been we've decided to like not move forward with with because like we just realized it's not a good fit in terms of like what the company's priorities are right now and also like the type of content that we're producing it's just uh, and the schedules and everything it uh, so right now we're very much like let's complete this let's do a great job let's finish this up and then we can spend time focusing on some of these other projects um we're in this like awkward little phase right now where we're wrapping up these projects that we decided that we no longer want to pursue with a pursue uh and then potentially investing time to starting these new projects that we are a lot more interested in but this has been such a good learning experience um you know working with these companies like realizing this we we 100 percent learned the hard way um you know there was times where like we we definitely didn't want to be working on these projects but obviously like we want to make sure that we're able to execute on them. And although the founders for these companies were really good people and the products that they're building are great, it just wasn't a good fit in terms of like this stage that these companies are at. So, you know, from this experience, we realized that the stage of companies that we want to work with going forward has to be like, they have to be a little bit later into like their startup journey. Um, and um, beyond that, they have to actually have, actually have like marketing people hired that are spending time on on like you know content marketing stuff like that because these two companies we work with right now like it's just two two co uh, two co-founders in, e in each company and um you know in the beginning it's all about just getting like users like getting the, your first customers so um yeah it was just it was just really hectic it was a little bit of a mess um but it was a good learning experience and um you know i, I just realized that like this new project that we're like potentially thinking well I don't know why I keep saying potentially. This new project we're about to start, we're technically about to bring on our first hire because we're going to be working with someone else on this project. And although like we're not going to be paying him anything, we're giving him somewhat of a stake in this specific project. So he's going to be like our first hire. And so far, man, like, like knock on wood, but things are going really smoothly. Like this guy is amazing, super dope dude. Uh, super enthusiastic, checks off all the boxes. Now, it's just that, is he going to actually like pull through? And is he going to actually be like, is he actually going to walk the talk? And I and I do think that he will, but I just feel like I have a bad track record of like people like, you know, making promises and then not following through. So I've become a lot more hes not he hesitant, but like skeptical of trusting people completely right from the get go. But got to stay positive. It's gonna end up working out and when it does it's gonna be amazing I'm, I'm trying not to think too far ahead and get too excited for like the outcome of this project but rather like look at like the execution of it because it is gonna be like it is gonna be somewhat time consuming and it's gonna be somewhat difficult uh but it's gonna be great you know like our whole thing's like we're planning everything out we're trying to systemize uh all the small aspects of it so that way, um, when we do execute on it, everything goes really smoothly and like we're able to stick to our plan because 
we've just realized that like the nature of the work that we're doing and especially like the stage that we're in right now there's just so many unpredictable variables things that come up um especially when you're working with other parties and like you know they let's say like are not necessarily following the schedules that you put out things just like completely fall out of order so even that's something that we took into consideration that in the future when we bring on clients we need to set very specific deadlines and like put that in a contract that like if they're not if they miss deadlines we're still getting paid and they're getting less you know like videos delivered to them because we can't do their our job if they're not doing theirs and we can't afford to like go past like our deadlines um so that is i think like somewhat of a tough conversation to have but i think that if i i, I think in, in the in the beginning of the project setting that straight and getting them to agree on that on paper um is like is like a no-brainer uh, obviously like they want the success they want this project to be successful as well so they're down for you know it to, it to go smoothly but obviously naturally there are moments where you know things come up um but the work still needs to get done like we can't afford to keep waiting for people um and that's something that we still need to like figure out so yeah that's that um today i'm finally finally gonna go play soccer uh so I'm excited about that. It's like really hot day as well, but you know, vibes, it's gonna be fun. So yeah, that is that. Um, things are going smoothly. Alhamdulillah. Next week is gonna be amazing, inshallah.